All right, everybody. So here is the beginning of my workspace. I have actually three workspaces. The first one, it's kind of our front counter area. And this is where I get together with primarily older ladies that like to do some newsletter folding and some other collaborative pursuits. And we get a bunch of time to talk and they're wonderful. Um, so let's go into the, the inner sanctum here. All right, so this was our receptionist desk. Uh, her position was eliminated, but I still need to do some work here because there's programs on this computer that are not on my own. All right, so then it's kind of a funky setup here, but we go through another door and go into my office. Sometimes I uh, daydream about um, getting rid of my clinical office furniture and replacing it with um, furniture from home. Um, when I was in graduate school, we had a writing center where you could take a paper and, and get help uh, editing or, um, you know, get a second pair of eyes reviewing a paper. And they had gotten all of the um, kind of clinical school furniture out of there and replaced it with kitchen tables and chairs. And it made that a much warmer, more relaxing place to go and have someone read your paper and give you feedback. Sometimes I daydream about turning my cubicle into what would feel like a home office uh, so that it felt that relaxing or pleasant for me to work or other people to come and um, collaborate on a work project. But I also don't want my workspace to turn into a lounge. The uh, other, um, I think, big difference between this workspace and other uh, workspaces, like when I was at State Farm Insurance, they had uh, uh, all these extra rules about cubicles and workspaces. Um, they were very particular about, um, you, know, you couldn't uh, have plants on a shelf that um, uh, was visible over the top of a cubicle, or you couldn't park a binder you know, on a shelf so that other people could see it. Um, I like when I can see a plant over somebody's cubicle, uh, that was an example of like, I don't know, kind of a cube farm gone bad, cube farm gone bad. Cube farm gone bad. You know, they just, it, it, I understood why they would do that, um, but it, it took um, what little humanity was left out of the office uh, with those extra rules. <laughs> 